Hey guys, so you're back in the barn. Um, this video is going to be about how to develop fast and brutal strikes with the self-defense training system three count chop drill. Now I do this, uh, probably not as much as I should, uh, but I'm going to try and, um, well I will up the ante and do this more because it's uh, says here as a core drill it's very effective uh, dramatically increase your hand speed and power while giving you an excellent cardio fast workout and it does now guys uh, before we get into it if you um, I you know really appreciate it if you could um, hit that subscribe button I've um, as I say in my other videos I've um, got a patreon account I've got you can um, donate Various cryptocurrencies. There are link, you know, links below to, that, to do that in the description. Um, you can also another thing you can do is um, you can watch this on BitTube. There should be a button uh, below this video. As soon as I put it up, it says uh, well, either watch on um, BitTube or um, donate BitTube. You can do both if you want, <laughs> but. Um, yeah, if you can't do anything else, uh, yeah, because if you watch it on BitTube, if you watch this on BitTube, under the video, they've got the ability for you to do a one-off donation. They call it tip, you know, like when you get tips. Give the waiter or waitress a tip in the uh, restaurant or cafe, or whatever. Uh, yeah, if you watch this on BitTube, uh, you can do the same thing, just a one-off, whatever, dollar. 50 cents, whatever. Um, yes, yeah, so um, I'll also put a link to a thing called Earthing. If you don't know about Earthing, you know, pretty much everybody works out, um, does some exercise, uh, you know, goes to the gym, you know, does some sport. If you want a faster recovery time, if you just want to Get rid of pain if you want to uh, get rid of any inflammation. Maybe you're an MMA fighter and you want to, you've got some inflammation in your hands and legs, whatever. Um, you want to start earthing. Earth gives off infinite electrons, which get rid of the free, free radicals in your system, where basically the human being is basically electrical magnetic. Being um, and the, because of the environment, the food we eat, the water we drink, um, you know, elect, uh, most humans are deficient in electrons because, uh, you know, because of those um, environment, food, water, etc. Um, now, once upon a time, when I first started earthing, like, I don't know, five or more years ago, Pretty much the only thing you could do to to Earth is to go and put your bare feet on the on the Earth. But now you can actually buy products, so you, you can actually be you can buy shoes that are Earth. You can walk around with shoes on and you'll be Earth. You can buy sheets, uh, so you can be Earthed all night. Now, what is one thing that Earthing does? Uh, eight hours while you sleep, it will normalize, uh, bring into balance the stress hormone cortisol, which is a biggie. Um, you can be, you can get an earthing mat, which you put under your keyboard while you're on your computer, so you'll be earthed while you're on your computer. Um, so that's a good one if you want, basically for your health. Um, you know, because we don't live in a, in a vacuum, you know. I like to um, give people uh, information about things that can help as far as health. Uh, health, uh, finances, etc. I'll show you this. It is very, it's simple, but it's effective. Now, you don't have to have a dummy. If you've got this sort of dummy, Bob the Centurion dummy, that's brilliant. That's all you need. However, in the past, I have, uh, I've got a sort of a couch with, um, you know, big, uh, arms, um, Armrests. What I do is I stand that up, put it against the wall, and uh, use that as uh, you know, uh, like a punching bag. But you can also do this on a punching bag. Um, anything that you can, um, 
Yeah, you don't you don't try this on your your obviously on your if you've got a partner because you can't go full on. Uh, you want something that you can go full on and um, non-stop. Um, so. I'll, Have a look at this. Yeah, so yeah, just improvise. You know, use what you've got. If you haven't got a bob at the moment, just improvise. Use this old sofa, or you know, a, um, I was even thinking of getting a um, what do you call it? A um, you know those flag stands or those uh, uh, basketball ho you know hoops that you can practice on. They've usually got a heavy uh, stand. You know, put put something over that, make a hole in the punching bag and put the punching bag um, over the, um, obviously take the basketball hoop off, put that over, you get mini basketball things, put that over the stand or flag stand that's bottoms filled with water or dirt so it doesn't move much. So it's pretty much just up to you. Anyway, let's have a look at this. Uh, hopefully the audio is good. Self-defense company. We're back in the barn to work with the drill called the three-count drill, and it is from the module one of the self-defense training system. Really, it's a great, great drill for developing hand speed, develop power, and develop uh, conditioning for your hands and all-over toughness. Uh, it's basically, two chops, vertical edge of hand and horizontal edge of hand. So it works like this: you're going to come in first to the collarbone with the vertical edge of hand. You're gonna pop over the other side, other collarbone. Snaps back, chin down as always, coming in with a horizontal edge of hand. Now, we don't really care about what targets we're hitting because we're above the collar. It's a target-rich environment. Neck, jawline, nose, head, temple. Of course, collarbone, throat. Doesn't matter. Uh, even if he puts his hands up, who cares? You're just chopping and hacking through it. You know, it's like if I gave you a chainsaw, you know, and you picked it up, would you say, oh, how do I hold it? You know, what angle? No. Who cares? You're just taking that chainsaw and you're just ripping through whatever's in front of you. Listen, here's the deal. I'm a nice guy, believe it or not. And, you know, I, you know, I've got friends, I've got family, the whole bit. Uh, but when it comes to that point, when you're pushed past that point and you're forced to do some things that you really wouldn't rather do, the only way to do them is ruthless, vicious, and full bore. Anything less leaves you open to be, to, to, for failure. That's it. So, working this three count chop drill, we're doing one, two, three, then the other hand comes in, one, two, three. Don't worry about how your feet move, they're going to move naturally, just don't stop them. All you're doing is chop, chop, chop. Keep your chin down. Keep your elbows up, and you're going to notice that as soon as you can, the more power you put into this, the longer it takes, which is fine. It's what's going to what's going to tell you how long to take and how hard to hit is how much damage you do to your target. All right, but for the drill, 30 second blast, hack that thing again. Like we say, hit with hate, hit the hurt. So, there you go guys, uh, very effective uh, for building up speed and uh, power. Because, you know, some people some people have already got that power uh, and they might just need the speed or some people have already got the speed and they might just need the power. So, cheers, have fun with that and uh, as Damien says, train honestly. And don't forget... I'd really appreciate it if you hit that subscribe button on the way out.